Seven on the shot clock for the Mountaineers. Bolden, left-handed, three, got it. There's Kanate in the post. Splits the double team and gets the right hand to go. Ball, certainly. Ahmad, nice pass, big to big. Logan Ralph finishes with a slam. That's going to be an and one opportunity for Issa Ahmad. He got the bump and the bucket. Hey, you were a step slow, but two steps ahead. Right now it's West Virginia who's ahead. A jump hook by Kalante. I like it. I like it. Jeff Cable the second was a great man, a great role model. Points on turnover as Peter Bolden knocks down the three. Chase Harler for three. And Deer blocked from Ahmad. That's the third block for West Virginia. Make it four, courtesy of Sags Kanate. Does that look familiar? Where have we seen that before? Napper off the window. Defense leads the offense. He gets it back. And Kanate with the flush. Inside Ahmad, quick yep. to the hole. Throw it inside. Oh, that's a good shot. Yep. Yep. For three. Yep. Well, Jeff Capel, when he came back to Duke from, uh, watch out here. That's what we're talking about. about Kanate. A... I love that. Take it to him. Harris with the shot clock running down. In this backyard brawl. McGowan's blocked from Guess behind. Who? Guess who? And Bolden pays it off at the other end. Kanate. Bolden. Oh! Get up, big fella! Gallon's on the run out. Step through, blocked from behind by Harris. The 186th meeting in the backyard brawl between West Virginia and Pittsburgh goes to the home team. The West Virginia Mountaineers now hold a 98 to 88 edge in the all-time series with a 69-59 win.